Do you run a website and you want to grow it? Well, I'm going to show you how I use three open source and self-hosted tools to build the ultimate SEO analysis out there. And then I automate the reporting using AI and NAN. So what are the three tools I use? Matomo, Umami, and Surpair. But before I go into each of the tool, let me show you the end result so you have an idea of what it's like. I want to grow my website, but Google Analytics is not enough. So what I do, I want to look at the data and make sure I, every week, based on the data, I make some changes to my content so it performs better. You'll see that I'm able to generate support for multiple sites to look at the page views, visitors, the change. Some of them doing well, some of them not doing well. I can dive in deeper and you'll see like the top pages that are performing well, pages that are not performing well. So you, you're digging deeper into the engagement and there's suggestions to change certain pages that are not performing well. And you can see a comparison of active users from last week to this week. You know, if there's a dip in active users, maybe there's something wrong with the content. I can see which countries I'm getting my most visitors and also have suggestions. So you get all this amazing analysis automatically every week using my system. But before we go there, I want to explain that if you want AI to do a good job, you need to feed it good data. And the problem is Google Analytics is not enough. And that's why you need to check out these tools. First, let's go into Umami is an amazing tool because Google Analytics is too difficult to use uh, and it suffers from data sampling. So you're not getting all the data. With Umami, you basically get real-time data. If you visit the site now, you'll see an extra visitor and you get the high level stats that you need, the views, the visit, the visitors, the bounce rate, the visit duration, everything you need is there. And it tells you the pages and refers which browser, so it's really powerful and you get to own all the data. So highly recommend this tool if you wanna see a high level view of how your website is doing. Then we'll move on to Matomo. Matomo is also great, but for different reasons. Yes, it does give you the high level details, but where it excels at is, it gives you granular detail of each individual visitor. So you see that I can see every single user coming in and what actions they have performed. So let's click on this one. This visitor came in and visited these three pages. They performed six actions and spent seven minutes. You can drill in and, and see what each visitor is doing. And you can do powerful stuff like, okay, I want to see who are the people that visit more than three times and what are their behaviors? Because this is important, right? You want people to come back over and over again. So that's amazing with Matomo. And then thirdly, I want to show you Surpair, which is not analytics, but actually how your keywords are performing on the site. So instead of paying for expensive tools, I use Surpair to track how my keywords are ranking and how they're performing over time. And you can see here that I'm ranking position 39 is flatlined. Maybe I can do something to improve this so I can rank higher. So there's a lot of things I can do based on this research. So now you've seen all my tools. You've got Matomo and Umami where it can give me analytics about how people are visiting my site, how much time they're spending in. And also you can see the data of organic traffic and how my keywords are ranking and how it's bringing more visitors. Then I use NAN to call the APIs for all three services. They all have APIs. And then I run a weekly report that sends the data to AI to generate a report for me. For each of the NAN workflows, I've created a separate video. Please check them out and I'll explain how you can use them yourself. Then I save all the reports into base row. So then I have a record of my changes over time. I have it for Surpair, I have it for Matomo. And then to make it even prettier, I save it into Notion and I compile a report. So then I can look back and track my changes over time. And this is important because you need to see how you're progressing not just on a week to week basis, but over months and a year, has the performance of my site gone up? If not, I need to do something to change it. And so that's my ultimate SEO analysis toolkit. If you've enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. And if you wanna get the system for yourself, I've created an AI and an SEO system that you can check out in the description below. I hope you can use this tool to grow your website and not just only rely on Google Analytics.